G'day, let's play some more of our Welsh Britannia campaign in EU4. So I was thinking about what we want to do, and we actually just want to get over and uh, declare on Tyrone, because he's only allied with these two. Somehow, uh, Kildare is allied to everybody, except uh, Northumberland. So, yeah, we'll come in here. Um, can't go Ligerise to Mond, because we've got the truce with them until 88. But, uh, yeah, we'll take them. We'll take as much as we can up here. The aggressive expansion is going to be a bit of an issue anyway. So we're going to go over to Pale. Uh, we are paying full maintenance at the moment, but that's fine. Um, so it's going to be them, them, and them. We'll have Ormond on our side, and we'll probably call Northumberland in just in case. Transfer trade power from France. Sure, we accept, even though it might knock us down a little. Oh, that knocked us down a lot. I wasn't expecting that much of a hit. Okay. Probably said no to France, but we definitely want to keep him on our side. Alright, he's rivaled Hungary and Castile and the Mamluks for some reason. Okay, so our boats should go somewhere safe. And we're safer than... Nah, Gwyneth's fine. Because we're not actually paying these guys, but we're not mothballing them, so that's okay. Now, I want to use this guy while he's still around. So, let's go declare war on them. Kildare would call in Scotland, so we're not doing that. But Ormond and Northumberland are a go. I want to go... What? Donny... Oh, right, because he took Donegal as well. Um, I think we just go for Tyrone. Should be fine. Bring it on. And then... This one. Well, that's not a huge difference. Just leave it on. Um, the biggest problem is going to be the fort in London, but I don't want to have to keep an eye on it. So he has a 4-2 there. I think that's our best spot to attack. Take out this 7 stack first. We'll be happy. I was expecting him to come in a little faster, but there they go. Um, he can go and deal with the other stuff. Hopefully he'll hand that over to us. And we're only up against 10,000 men. So the reason I was happy to call Northumberland in was... Oh, I forgot. We're trying to get Gwyneth on the throne. Um, because... It's only another two years until we can call him into a second war anyway. And we would just want to call him in against England. Really, I guess. Um, even if he doesn't hand these over, England's still 130, 174%. Um, so we could start with just the southern area to stop France coming over. Alright, we're going to need to start taping up for the next tech. And haven't even thought about the institution yet. London should get it relatively quickly. Northumberland already has it. That should be getting it to Gwyneth, one would hope. Look at the right thing. 0.83 per month, so it's still a little slow. Too many military leaders. Yes, I had forgotten about that. Um, that's fine. Well, you know, we only have one army. So we'll get rid of this guy. And they'll have to ship people over too slowly to be able to do much there. So what are we looking at? It's all Tyrone. And yeah, money's not great. Oh, there's Tyrone. Ah, good. Gives Northumberland something to do. And they're starting to spread out now that his army's dead. Or oh, getting chased at least. Profiteering in Bristol. He is transferring good. Northumberland's opinion comes down. Gloucester gets less unrest. Right, he's just going around being annoying to them. As long as they transfer everything, we're happy. We've won Sildara. Let's go up to Tyrone. Don't like that he's trying to get a three stack there, but he sees what's happening up this side. Yeah, he's been caught. They'll have nowhere to go. No. Um, how do we do this? I want to go leave four. Northumberland's losing that. I don't know how they manage that boss. It was like seven onto three and he lost it. Alright. Donegal.
There we go. Uh, we'll do a little looting over there, I guess. Uh, diplomatic idea. Only if we've gone over, which pretty sure we have not. So, no, I'm going to save up for tech because we're particularly far behind in Diplo and we want to catch up properly. Should win that before we win the war goal. Thank you, Northumberland. Get in there. Scare him off. He's got a 1 2. Hey, 1 2. Oh, you slippery little bugger. We could just give it to him, it'll make it easier. Who are they allied to? Just us, yeah. Doesn't want vassalization though. Economic base, that whole thing is nonsense. We're obviously got a better economic base than this two province minor. Um Alright then. Tamond, we'll give to them. And call them into another war. Should get we don't even get favours for that. Alright, say goodbye to them. And then up here, I'd love to take everything he has. Forgot about Kildare. Alright. Well, let's start with Kildare. It's not a real problem, it's just Scotland. Okay. So we'll buy them down. Um, who was the one we didn't have? Okay. And next one. So if we take everything here, that's a bit more of a problem. Um, could wait for a call for peace. Occupied home provinces. Uh, really? Where? Blockade, I believe. Nothing here is occupied. Nothing here is occupied. Um, do they have... Yeah, they have no army. So, let's... Stop paying ours. And we stop paying the fleet. Should still loot when I'm not getting paid, right? get a few ducats. So, French opinion is maxed out. Is there anyone else? Desmond, Hess, Brunswick, Baden, Veden, Monster, Saxony, maybe. Palatinate, actually, because he's the emperor at the moment. Alright, let's get over to the Palatinate. I'll we'll improve relations with him. <laughs> That's ridiculously close. Um, I mean, he gets it because he's a current emperor, but if anybody changes their vote... Actually, there we go. Brandenburg's going to become the new emperor. And it'll be pretty soon. Alright then, Brandenburg. It's a lot further away. No. Alright, we're definitely not buying this one down though. We'll let it uh, trend down after the war. Alright, so the other thing is... Desmond is allied to Northumberland. So we'll declare on them when we drag Northumberland and Ormond into a war against Scotland would be best. Scotland's allied with Brittany and France. Well, I guess that's not going to happen because Brittany's allied to France as well. It does mean... We just have to do it when we go to war with England. Which should be fine. So, England has no forts and his capital is in Norfolk. I think it was 94, so five years from now. We'll take another giant chunk out of England. Then we need to break these alliances so we can eat them. 
All right, granted, Admiral ship is gone. Mamluks, have a go, Nero. Oh crap, we need to give them more land, obviously. Um, we should probably actually start doing this. So the burgers are going to have London. There's nothing else of particular importance over there. So I guess Oxford can go to the clergy. Gloucester can go to... Well, actually, let's go Cornwall. No, it's worth too much. Devon can go to the nobility. Nobility do want 15%. Alright, so Gloucester goes to nobility. Oh, so. And now everything there is looking good. And grant the monopoly charters. Seek support of the clergy. Send emissary to the Pope. Um, we're done. Calling the Diet. We'll take 100 military. We'll take 150 admin. And... Tithes Defended will be gone in 10 years. It'll come down 10 or go up 10. So what did we end up on? Yeah, no, it's too much of a risk. We'll just take the 100. And I wouldn't mind getting this up again. It's only 18 ducats. Get over 60 for the Papal Influence. How old are we? 62. Well, crap. <clears throat> Next guy's a Gwyneth as well. You know what? I wouldn't mind him dying. If we have a chance of becoming a de Valois, it would really cement our alliance down there. So, let's make a, uh, an unused general. And let's go two lots over there, one lot over here. Despite the devastation we're going to create. That should finish roughly the same time, right? Alright, it's July. I mean, we're not doing anything else, so we might as well just sit on these guys until the call for peace. Times of need. Asking her for money or gain prestige. We shall ask for some money. Sure, they don't have a whole lot. Might get like two ducats. Ooh, ten ducats. Our opinion of them comes up. We are good friends. Alright, are we... No, we didn't get the access through Scotland. Well, they broke it with us anyway. Access through Northumberland, we need to keep. And give them access through us. It doesn't matter so much. Alright, well, it's 1490. I'm sure somebody's... No, nobody's taken it yet. Somebody's taken the military, though. 40% penalty I would like to get rid of. Um, what is the next one again? Colonialism. Yeah. Lose Diplo. I'll wait until we get this, and then we'll uh, let that trigger. Not even close, right? No, zero provinces. London is only 20 development. Okay, finish coring this. Alright, the Manx. Ah, that's the one that's occupied. Okay. And just... Oh, God damn it. Because it didn't pause at the start of the month, so it went off at the same time. <laughs> mm -hmm. So we're going 10% of our development. Which is actually just London. Straight out. How much it would cost us? Uh, lose Diplo, lose Splendor. I haven't even considered this. We have really no Splendor. We're gonna care. I mean, free war taxes won't make a huge difference. Aggressive expansion impacts the only thing we really want. Extra morale of armies for 20 years is definitely worth it. Let's lose the admin, the ducats, and the Splendor. Have a huge morale of armies for the next um, English war. 
He was only four years out. And we have looted the bejesus out of this. So let's go chill over here for a bit. And there's our call for peace. And it is December. So let's just wait till January. See just how bad this is going to be. It'll be exactly the same, actually. So let's do it now so we don't get the extra little thing. Tiny bit of war exhaustion. All right. So who is it? England, Scotland, Desmond, Tyrone, Brittany, Provence. All kind of small. We've got France on our side, so nobody should really have an issue. Uh, man, we're still not going to do. We can select a naval doctrine now. Thought you had to be English for this. Must just be we English culture, not institutions. I want the um, one behind that. Except cultures. British. Yes, you must have to be the British thing. All right. Uh, wooden wall. Chance capture. Ship trade power. Galley combat ability. Naval maintenance. I'm thinking wooden wall. Because we're only going to do stuff around where we are. And we need another rival. Okay. Who was that? That's the one we just ate. All right. So, I think rivaling Scotland. We could rival Ormond to drop the alliance. I'd rather use them another time, though. So, we'll rival them maybe later. If we've got a better army in Scotland, then it seems okay. Actually, that was screwed with France. Probably shouldn't have done that. Um, Joey, Provence. Provence is also allied to France. We're definitely not touching that. Um, Jaure is only allied to Cologne. Let's choose Jaure. Brittany. Brittany's allied front. Yeah, alright. Jaure is the only one. Conquered promises from Tyrone's only plus nine. Alright, um, we should actually do this before we do the tech. Well, this is one that could give us innovativeness. So I guess it's probably a good idea. We can hold out on these for a little bit. It's just corruption. Uh, Alright. And yeah, still not paying. Now we don't need to pay for the Ford either, so we can get some money together. Big question is, how much is this going to cost? Why is Gwyneth... Oh, we've already got it in London. Fair enough. Oh, it takes local autonomy into account, of course. So we do still have to wait for it to spread, which is super unfortunate. Oh, nobody's taken it yet, though. Rise of a Pretender in Montgomery. Alright, well, Yago's in. Montgomery is hills. This doesn't take very long to get there. Uh, France. Yes. Ormond. Nyasa. Nyasa Butler. So, if we die, we become de Valois. Should put our guy in charge of the uh, army then, shouldn't we? Alright, Denmark, absolutely. Uh, done improving with Planet. Muskie's going to take Lithuania again. Um, Planet, we can be friendly. Can't quite get the alliance, but that is ridiculously close. Diplo rep is down just because of the yeah. All right. Privilations would actually be good to have. Yeah, we'll need. Need improved relations to get rid of some of this aggressive expansion, particularly in France. Marriage with Northumberland is acceptable. Alright, well, big Wales. It's feeling good so far. Another thing is Desmond. No, Northumberland. I remember that now. Alright, so. Uh, yeah. Nobody's taken that yet. Oh crap, forgot they were coming out. Damn it, we're going to lose that now. 
Oh, it's super close. He had a good roll at the end. <coughs> and Brittany's entering a coalition. Well, surprising, given that France, let's say, should defend us. Yeah, he's not at war with anyone. Scotland's ends the coalition. Desmond's ends the coalition. Means we need to declare war on uh, England the second we have the opportunity. Right, grasslands, grasslands, hills. Hopefully, he just walks to Gwyneth. Actually, should probably take a look at the Pretender, hey? Uh, remember where to find it. A 2 2 2. Go to hell. Can't remember if he take a stability hit when they win. Pretty sure he would. Alright, let's go catch him over here. Oh, we claim... God damn it. Definitely need a claim on England. Alright, military tech. Somebody else already has it. Put infantry fire during this fight. Sounds like an idea. Next month is still okay by the looks. I wonder why no one's taken admin. Alright, killed them. 1st of December. One point short, seriously. Ah, I forgot that we died and we've got a terrible admin dude. Um, gotta pick another thing too. We wanted quality, right? For the discipline or quantity? Oh, God, I don't know. Right, here we go. Admin. More innovation. 22.2. .2. So what's that? A 2.2% power cost reduction. This is past the act of uniformity for missionary strength. Uh, not right now, but probably later. Alright, we're all sorted again. Actually, we wanted to do this, so let's keep paying them. Ormond has died. Alright, Butler. We become De Valois, he becomes Gwyneth, he's 66, he will die first. Getting a P over him would be good. Hmm, could be a bit rough. Traveling Minstrel, gain stability. Awesome timing. How are we looking on the Manx? 60%, 4 years. Should be fine. More exhaustion still trickling down. Alright, we can make a state of the Isles. Now that we're finished with man. It seems like a complete waste. So, let's not actually do that one. We'll save our uh, states for useful things down here. Right, it's 92. We're up in March of 94. I have to make sure our army's ready for it. And the fort, I guess. Oh, Ormond. Conquest Cork against Desmond, who is allied with Northumberland. You bastards. Um... Lose prestige, lose declare rep. Yeah, you know, screw them. Not going to war with Northumberland. We need them against England. It's a lot more important than what they were trying to do to us down there. And they're in the coalition against us, aren't they? Yeah. Alright, so 13 years. Then we get Reformed Galaglis. Provence is in the coalition. Awesome. France down to 45. Uh, Sax Lauenberg is the new emperor. Okay. Because of expansions, two per year. So, why did Sax Lauenberg get it? Not. Uh, Brandenburg becomes a question. Nobody liked the Palatinum enough. Brandenburg's backing themselves. Trier's backing them. And there's two for Sax Lauenberg. Ooh, he's voting for Platinum now, though. Oh, that was very close for the Platinum. Alright, Sax Lamberg, how old are you? 53. Personal union on Monarch Death. Well, that's not what we want to happen. 
Alright, not Northumberland, we want... Well, where do we actually want the claim? I'm assuming Essex. 14. Norfolk's 10. Alright, Essex shall become the war goal. And we'll keep going there to... Yeah, you should be able to get another claim before we go to war. So... It's not good. Don't want to have to break free from France, that'd be a nightmare. How old are we? 45. And we're a general. We can't really go around marrying everyone. Oh, I should have uh, done the thing with them. Oh. They're feeling threatened by us. Although, apparently Desmond's going to overrun them instead. <coughs> Which would be fine as well. Oh god, I don't like even saying that. Alright, it's April. We should stop drilling now. Walk over to London. Um, we can unmothball this closer to the dime. And the Manx are getting close. Right, I'm going to forget this. So we'll have to buy them down after all. Which means it would have been better off doing it straight away. Would have ticked down more by now. Hey, there we go. 4 to 2 air. Suck that, France. Traherne, Gwyneth. This was March, right? Yep. So we do have time to do another claim, which will be on... Kent. Yep. And there it comes. So, fabricate claim Kent. We will bring this guy back. And I forgot that we haven't actually started any of these. That'd probably be a good idea. Desmond has rivaled us. Oh, he completely ate them. So the problem is he's allied with Northumberland and we can't declare on him because of the coalition. Ormond separatists are in uh, Scotland. Well, what did they do to you, buddy? What's Scotland got at the moment? Britain and France, right. Got to make sure that France always love us so they don't drop us in favour of Scotland. It's going to be particularly important because of the aggressive expansion we're about to get. So you know what? We'll probably lose France. And we'll have to get Castile. It should be possible once we lose France. Alright, there goes the truce with England. Do not give them a chance to enter the coalition. Uh, we don't want to offer Northumberland land. We've got 17. Why can't we call them in? We refuse to call the arms. We must not have changed the thing yet. Alright, so let's go for Essex, because it's on the way to Norfolk. Uh, Liège. Allied with Munster. It doesn't really matter. Let's just confirm this. Going to wander over this way. It's got an 11 stack with a 3 3 leader. Well, that's really not cool. So we need to call Northumberland in. Um, trust is gone. Ah, oh, because we. Yeah. Any chance of Diplo rep? Not for that price. Um, I mean, we can promise him land and then just lose the alliance. I really wanted to keep him for this, though. Well, the more important thing is making sure we win. So we'll promise him land. We'll deal with the rest of it later. Oh, god damn it. We lost our only decent general. Where's the arrow? He was our only general. Alright then. Grant generalship. Be good. A 115. Right. Um, we shall lose Diplo. And repay a loan. Is that our only loan? Yeah. Alright, got Essex. God, they're terrible. Alright, I'm getting to Norfolk. At the moment, we've done 
how does he think he's doing more than us when he's just standing there and we're doing a siege? Ah, because his boats were under attack. England's built two heavies as well. Alright, now it's coming back in our favour. So if we throw our boats away, then we'll be fine as well. He's probably just going to not hand anything. Yeah, look at that. Um, have a little professionalism. Unrest in the Leinster area is a nightmare though. So it is unfortunate. Yeah, they're going to be annoying. There's no way we're going to take on his two heavies. Relentless drill. Wait, hey, morale of armies again. Alright, so we should actually be able to take them on. We've got five. Not sure what they've got. Should be significantly less. So, what we're going to do... <coughs> we're going to leave one man behind. We're going to join up with this army to attack England now. Come on. Turn around, you bugger. Alright, I guess if you want to go and do that, you can attach to them. Alright, grasslands, coastline. Stand in Devon. Could actually just block them in for a bit. And now Brandenburg's been elected. And there's no way of us getting an alliance with them. Quite happy to just hold him in there. Because he's got a 3 3. So I don't really like our chances of winning that. 9 on 12 in particular. Hmm. Well, if he's not attacking us, it means we must be okay. Uh, we can get three more guys. Let's do so. France has died. Devalua would become Toko. Devalua would become Toko. Who's Toko? Didn't really expect it to be them. Uh, Wales, Brittany, Provence, Florence. Is a republic. Provence is. It's a claim on Scotland. Um, Brittany is de Dreux. Who the hell was Toko? It's Gerald Gwyneth, Letter Spencer, de Dreux. Hey, we've won Norfolk. Well, he's got his air now anyway. Okay. Well, yes, let's kill this guy. Good enough. Drag these drag these guys down to do the battle. Make sure they get in first. He only has a 1-1 one, one leader as well, but um Let's just run straight past. Reinforce behind. Smash them and we'll try and spread out so they can't uh, withhold from us. Alright, 12th. 12th. Let's actually group these up. Because otherwise one guy will get in and get smashed. Oh, look at that. Alright. I'm quite fond of that. We'll leave their guys... Leave their guys behind. We'll get out. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten provinces, and we have 13 men. So let's go split, 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 split. Alright. 12 armies. Good enough. him to anything. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. But that was actually the two stack going that way. So they say goodbye to the English army again. Now, money wise, we should be doing a bit of looting while we're here. That'll keep us safe. Otherwise, we don't actually need to pay the army anymore. Alright. Says 98. 
Ah, because of Liege. Which one's Liege again? The tiny little one sandwiched in. I suppose you want to get out at any point. I guess we could get him as a vassal. Not really worth it. So, how much of this did they do? They think they deserve half. That is unfortunate. Reduce trust by four. <coughs> Reduce trust by six. Well, let's just give them a chance to peace out for themselves. We're going to wait for... Uh, Yeah, we should send some guys over there. Um, there and there. Yeah, we'll wait for the call for peace. We'll loot as much as we can while we're not paying the army. And once we get the call for peace, we'll decide whether we want to actually give these guys anything or not. Or how much we want to actually take, because aggressive expansion is our issue, really. Okay. So England's 175% before, I think. 174%. A diplomatic idea. Do we need prestige? Not as much as we need to catch up on tech, I imagine. Trade range, noble morale, shipyards, and extra promoted culture. Okay, um, the other thing is, they don't have an army, so let's stop paying for the fort. Northumberland is dead, so I'm thinking we don't want to get the marriage back. Allied with Munster, Desmond, Wales. Desmond is in the coalition, is the problem. Now yeah, they're going to take too long to come out of the coalition. Uh, wouldn't mind improving relations with them, though. Yeah, they want a lot of land. And they're our rival. Good point. Need the coalition to collapse. And there we go. Consort Regency is a 534. That's decent. It's 12 years worth. Could do with admin points. Um, don't care about missionary strength, so I guess production efficiency gives us a tiny bit of money. Royal marriage with France is an absolute must. Denmark, Northumberland, France. And then we lost the guy that died. All right. Guess we can drop our access through Northumberland. Exiled armies in... Ah, because we don't have access. Yeah, right. Just turn around. We do have access because we're in the war together. Keep the loot going. And then we're going to look for another ally. Um, <coughs> Cologne, potentially in the right kind of an area if we're going to expand this way. We did rival Gelray, didn't we? Yeah. Alright, who else has Munster, Friesland, Liege? So, Munster's good to give us an alliance. We could use him against Gelray for points. Gelray, for some reason, have no allies. Alright. Um, Munster. Going to start improving with you. It's a bishopric, so luckily we don't have to worry about uh, marriages and stuff is going on over here. Scottish noble rebels. Hmm. Well, at least Germany don't care too much about what we're doing to England. Hey, it's starting to come back up. What are we getting? Duck at 20. Muscovy's going to attack Kazan. We'll end up having to Novgorod. It still exists. <laughs> I 
Alright, uh, wasn't Muscovy going to attack Lithuania again? Ooh, Crimea's taking a chunk out of Lithuania. Who is allied to Poland, so it's surprising. Trutons took that little bit of Poland. Okay. Trudicadel. Let's have a quick peek. I mean, I don't really mind feeding Northumberland a bit more if we keep them as an ally because of it. Really just want to keep them under 100% though, so. And they'll take them to 99 just having these two. So maybe we should just play it safe and take less, but then. England's still going to be annoying afterwards. Forget these guys all together. Then it'll be a minus 20. Uh, lose stability, lose money. That's an easy choice. Alright. Just buy these guys back up. Want to keep them for a war against Scotland. So this is taken back down to 60, and then 9 years from now, yeah, I mean, seems fine. Are these the provinces we want? I think it's good. It separates his capital. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 left there. We can finish him off in the next war. I think this is what we want to do. I don't think we'll be able to wait long enough to get Arkin and Cologne out of the coalition. So we might as well do it as soon as we have this many points. And then really need a huge period of peace to recover from the aggressive expansion. Although, we could do the thing against... Uh, was it? Jelro. Because it would just be a uh, humiliate rival to get points. So that wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Oh, look at this. 89 ducats now. So we might be able to get ahead of time on military. Get the innovativeness. And of course, this is slowly trending up because we're ahead of time on admin. Just, yeah, don't want to take that until we've done it. Um... Oh, and the next one's about to start as well. So I think once... Maybe Devon, but definitely Oxford. Once they're done, we'll go for it. What are we looking at? Glamorgan. Glamorgan's only on 55. There's our call for peace. Um, God. I think it's one. Yeah, Alright, I don't think we'll be ahead of time on admin. We will peace out now. Peace them out separately would have been nice. Uh, we're going to grab this. So what if we were to take... That's 98. We're in a 12. Coventry. Lancashire. Not doing Lancashire. No, Shrewsbury's fine. Or do we want Coventry? No, sh no. Cologne and Arkin would be gone at the end of the year. Too bad. Declare. We declare you free, England. We will buy these down. What was that? Kent was kind of low. Okay. And then war exhaustion is fine. So do the big ones. And watch everyone get super ticked off at us. But we will go stand in London. French line rest is not a real thing. And we would like to declare war on Gel Ray while he has no allies. Now he has... Oh, forgot about the whole empire thing. Okay. Uh, well, Brandenburg and his allies make that a rather different story. So we will be at peace for a long time. And no point paying the fleet. Scotland is right with us. Scotland has left the coalition. Provence has left the coalition. Desmond has left the coalition. Brittany has right with us. Brittany has left the coalition. The coalition is now completely non-existent. 
Desmond. Oh, crap. All right, we've got the spine work. We need to take that. Um, looks like perfect time to attack Scotland if we could call Northumberland in, which we can't because of that. Unless he'd come in for territory. He's allied with France anyway. So we have to do it this way. All right, so we need to build up the spine work. And if we're going to keep Northumberland, we'll get the marriage. Okay. Well, I'm take a short break here. <laughs> and uh, when we come back, we'll tool up for a war against Desmond, who was allied with Scotland. No, Northumberland. Crap, I forgot that was, I thought it was uh, those two. Oh, we'll uh, see how it goes anyway. Maybe we'll take over Northumberland land. It's only on 85. How did I add that up wrong? All right, Friesland and Gelray join in. So the coalition will probably reform again. But yeah, thanks for watching. See you soon.